Not many ticks on the benches today. But it's been a nice weekend, so the ticks will be feasting on people. I know one tick's been feasting on me. I saw the gardeners a couple of weeks ago. And I was, well, every year I see the gardeners and mention the ticks to them. And every year they say the same thing. They've never seen a tick. They've never had a tick bite. I was here Friday looking at these ticks and I was crouched for about a minute and then suddenly realised that my coat was touching the floor and my heart sunk because I knew a tick would be on me and I searched thoroughly, I could not find a tick on me and then this morning I noticed one buried quite close, well near my armpit, near where my bag strap goes and it's all red and irritated so my bag strap's been irritating it I managed to pull the tick out, but its head stuck in me and it's sore now, which is... I've been watching the ticks for over 10 years and I've noticed the tick problem escalate really badly over the past maybe eight or nine years. I can't do a lot of the macro photography that I used to do because if I go to the places I used to go, I'll get covered in ticks because I have to kneel in grass and stuff. And a lot of the habitat that I used to watch, all the spiders and everything, it's gone. It's been wiped out by the um, Conway Council because apparently people complain about the wildflowers and wildlife. So they get rid of it. I'll leave all these ticks. But how can the gardeners who work every day, all day, in Holford Gardens say they've never seen a tick or never had a tick bite? They must have had a tick bite. I mean, I know if I put my hand down, I'll let my coat drop on the floor now. I'll get a tick on me within a couple of minutes. Apologies, little tick. I killed your friend this morning. If the rain stops and it dries up, these ticks will get a meal today. They disappear very fast from these benches. Right near the toilet. On Friday there was ticks on here. There's no ticks on these now. be on people or people's dogs. 